Looks like it's going to take us up here. We can really skip that quest, I think. Uh, uh that's one for the fake pass. Yeah, I think so. We got a real pass from the Baron. Right, so. I mean, we'll go here anyway and talk to the guy, but I'm pretty sure. You never win at slots? Well, well, you know, I'm sorry. That, that really is a uh, sharp way to talk. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's only a one in nine chance. That's one in nine for everybody, so there's that. That was one in eight. No, the payout is eight times. The win chance is one out of nine. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. So you'll win one out of every nine times on av average. That doesn't necessarily mean you will win one out of every nine times, but should average out to that. Because yeah. there's only three modes in the slots. Three modes. Three emotes, yeah. Oh, three emotes, right, right. So it's one and nine, right? Yeah. All right. We're traveling to... Hanged Man's Tree. Oh, Hanged fellas. Man. Yeah. Hanged Man's Tree. Mm. All right. So from here we're going um here So it says I can leave the road here. Faster. They did patch roads quite a bit. I remember when this game first came out, it like roach is almost unbearable to ride. I would I, I preferred to run everywhere. Oh my gosh. Shady Merchant. Let's talk to the Shady Merchant. Let's see what we want. Interest you in a pass. Shape the round. Right here. Uh, how much for a pass? What? Could dress up like Radovid and buy a gilded carriage for that much. What am I to do if you can't afford it? You know what? No deal. Whoa, 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 hold up. Might have a little work for you. Reduce the price for a job well done, eh? Kind of work. What kind of work? Nearby. Just to the southeast. My sister's husband's got a business. He and some lads tidy up battlefields. Problem is, there's always swarms of shite bothering them. You know, them monsters drawn to corpses. Give them some protection, and I'll swing you one... Beautiful discounts. I think I'll swing your discount just because. Hi. Good idea. 
this can't yours, my friend. That's better. Pleasure doing business with you. Did you bring me something to eat? No? Devilry. that for 50 I should have said I don't think about it but it did complete the quest and you got your pass well, I already had a pass oh, you did? yeah that one from the bed I had a legit pass hey yeah if you bought one from this guy, you would need to, to get one from the Baron with you. Yeah, I think they don't take your pass. Come on, Roach. No, they'll Snow look up the fake pass, oh. too. Do I? They'll look maybe, up the fake pass, don't. too. Maybe go for yourself. Oh, freak. Bridge is literally being held up by boats. That's one way to do it, I guess. Look how they reinforced the bridge. They they've used boats to reinforce it. Oh. What? You don't build bridges on boats? No. That's just silly. A bridge on a boat? <laughs> they reinforced the bridge by putting boat wooden boats underneath the bridge. Oh. <laughs> well, the foundation of the bridge is boats. Like the wooden rowboat. Which, I, I guess, with a, a bridge that's that low is kind of smart because if the tide comes in, the bridge will just float up. Instead of, you know, sinking under it with, if you reinforce it with posts. What are with these again? I thought there was something to do. Maybe that's the first game, like you had to place a candle on each one. Hey, look, it's John Verdon. I don't know. I don't remember you. Which, uh, John Verdon, remember? He saved me from the drowners. It was Coppola's Oh, then. yeah. Now, why, well, my purse is bursting. Mm hmm. With coin that belonged to the refugees. Vengeance tastes sweet. I thought you'd come for your reward. I'll gladly pay, mind you. You've saved my life. No two ways about it. But if you're looking for a bruising, well, you'll find it. Should have left you back there on the bank. Should have left you there, tied up right at the water's edge. Well, you can't turn back time. 
But I'm willing to see to it your conscience don't torment you long. Get him! Say that. I said I'm hungry, and she thought I said I'm horny. That's not what I said at all. But you are? <laughs> no. Oh man. Sorry, Shark Bait right, Tech. tech. You, these guys just don't really do it. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. So you're saying. into Geral, is what you're saying. Oh, hell yeah. Geralt's a sexy, fine specimen. He's a beast. I said I'm hungry. She says, what? <laughs> You said something else. <laughs> no, lady, I'm hungry. <laughs> Jeez. <sighs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, let's uh, quest it up. Let's go talk to Twist Marigold. Hobbits. Good day. See, that says dwarf. That says halfling. Clearly, there are hobbits in the game. I think the lady's grown tired of your company. Lady? What lady? See her ears? She elf. And everyone knows elves are always doing something on the sly. I'm not doing She's not scoyed, I, I must just fetch some water. Where will you put it? Uh, Where's your jar, eh? Where's your bucket? Bucket three? Um. Oh, I mean, I don't know. They are. Yeah. They're still around. They're just more underground than they were in the first two games, I guess. I haven't ran into them. Did you encounter them? Yeah, you'll encounter them every now and then. Why don't and you then. just tell the truth? The, they, uh, there's only a couple camps, I think. She's a non-human. Lions in their blood. 
Don't let that fair face beguile you, Witcher. Pretty as a picture on the outside, she elves, with the most vile filth within. Leave her be. By what right you giving me orders, eh? Let's go, Renny. Killing's like batting the knife for Witchman. You can breathe. It's over. Over? For you, perhaps. You'll go on your merry way. But I must stay here. And they will, too. Nothing I can do about that. Then why get involved at all? You didn't scare those boars off for my sake. For your own. To feel just and noble. A knight on a swiving white steed. What do I have it all on? Go, Vatgern. And remember, we neither need nor want your pity. I'm not helping you for pity. I would do the same for any race. We can go in here, Look at that walk there. Witch hunting or sorcerer hunting? Could survive the holy fire. The holy fire in lions burns and cleanses. Behold the flame of grace and mercy. Special fire for you, freak. Nice, slow burning. You'll beg for mercy in all the voices known to you. Sorcerers, and sorcerers at the stake. Truly sad. Sure, hope Dudu hasn't met the same fate. Why the stench is entirely different. a witcher of unsullied uh, reputation who will undertake the task of combining the residents of the on the outskirts of the city recently acquired by the un 
designed. Undersigned? Count Kerr Dicer. In order to find and drive off or kill the creature which is haunting it. Size of reward is guaranteed. Count of Anchor by Writ of King Foltus. We'll get there. In here. Let's talk. Not here for the loot. Interested in the sorcerers who lived here. We're supposed to believe that. Yeah. Most likely I did in some rat trap <laughs> with the Stand. rest of them. What? Okay. A new mercenary was just discovered. What's his uh, name? Sa Salmonellios the Raw. As for why this mercenary is called the Raw, it's pretty simple. Salmonellios used to eat raw chicken every day as he thought it would make him more muscular. The only thing that happened was he got sick. This is from, you know, Sal Salmonellios. Salmonellios got it. <laughs> Salmonellios the Raw. Who's she hiding from? <laughs> Temple Gorge cracking down. All majors of I always knew you had salmonella attack. Like rats. <laughs> Someone's got to know more. I'd look for her in a putrid grove. Lovely name. Putrid Grove. Interesting, his names go. A hive of scum and freakery if there ever was one. No decent folk show their hides there. That why you think I should look for my friend there? Oh, I meant no offense. Putrid Grove. Where is it? I wouldn't know. Rumor has it, it's a place for freaks and oddities. You'd fit in well there. Maybe. Thing is, gotta know how to get there. They say you gotta get there through the sewers, but you gotta enter them outside of town. If you know where exactly, though, ask a beggar. Or spot yourself a thief. Follow him. Beggars and thieves gotta pay tribute to the king of beggars. Word is, they do it in the grove. Mean to say the local beggars have a king, crown, scepter, and all that? Wouldn't scoff, mate. King of beggars, it's a moniker. Yeah, for a man who everyone in Novigrad respects deeply. And watch yourself. Menger himself don't even go to the grove. Shove on call for me. Wonder why. Menger. Temple God. Thieving vermin to the confession chamber. What, but sir, what's the offense? This is some sorcerous bitchy shop. Think that gives you the right to steal her property? Well, sorcerers, majors of all types, are outlaws. But by law, the Temple Guard takes possession of their belongings, and the rule of law still holds in Novigrad. You know a bat can sniff out a moth a mile away. It's about the hearing, not since the smell. Got nothing to do with their sense of smell. It's about their hearing. Well, well. Man knows his bats. Here I thought you only cared about monsters. And as bats sense moths, so I sense freaks. And start by warning them. Novigrad's no place for your kind. I can't wait to kill you. I haven't done anything wrong, but you will. Sooner or later, your sort always causes trouble, and this city's mine to protect. 
mine, and the eternal fires. Nothing I can do to you now, but just know that I know you're here. One misstep, one error, you'll make a mistake, it's inevitable. Uh, I'll be the first to learn of it, and when I do, I hate the it'll be fire. standard procedure. Like for every magic oddity who dares taint this city's air. What did they do to you? Be seeing you. <laughs> well, they start out as, uh... They started off as simple monster hunters, just like Geralt. But when you first met Sigrid, before they became the Eternal Fire, they were the Holy Flame or whatever. Mm. Uh, but then they went to persecuting and purifica uh, purification of any, or purging anyone who wasn't human. Sorceresses, elves, dwarves. Uh, that's right. Yeah, they were kind of like jerks. Yeah. And I'm a witcher, so. But they you don't were like me before you became a witcher. Yeah, well, yeah, but he was probably a, that was probably a hundred years ago when he was a little boy. Deepest apologies, Governor. Fetch some metal, you wretched. I've been robbed! Thief! I miss a woman's touch. Hmm. What next? Discretionary tribute to benefit Redania or exile. Eternal fire walk with you. Stop, thief. Why am I not finding the thief? Which your sense don't work on thieves? Come on now. Any needs, master? Yeah, I think you gotta catch them in the act, so... I think those zones were targets that he could steal from. Either that or they're near beggars. Don't touch me. How is business? More cautious than I thought. Can't get too close. Floating in the air, you know that? Okay. As long as you knew. Give us a crown, eh? My mum's sick, and if I don't feed her, well, she's like to die hunger. Well, I find the king of eggs. All right, I'll give you some coin. 
But you gotta tell me where the Putrid Grove is. I don't know that. Keep your coin, I don't know a thing. Move on. Be gone! What's up? Follow a lurfin. start it in a couple of hours. Open up. Um, we'll probably draw it a long, Who are you? Probably a long time from now. Probably six. Yeah. We got back there. Doing some sightseeing. Kind of curious about what's beyond this gate. My brother-in-law was curious. Worms. Been eating him for five years now. Can't tell a free. Take a look. What do you see? Yellow. Yeah, no, subs only. Is it? It's for everybody. Mutated killer. Maybe. Heard this place was a meeting spot for oddities. And right. I don't do no subs only. Password. Get him free. Don't know it. Got to contribute to the Graves upkeep. Don't know the password. Pay up. Let me in. Yes, sir. I won't pay. You will let me in. I love being a Jedi. All right. <laughs> Fando using his Jedi mind tricks. Hey, look, there's Triss. I found her. 
About time we made something clear, sorceress. Yes, high time. Me and my men will manage just fine without the help of you or any other mages. But you, well, without our help, you're sitting ducks for the temple guard. Who do I spy? Geralt? Atreus. See you two know each other. See you two know each other well. I was curious whether you'd managed to find me, Witcher. Got something to take up with me? Am I mistaken, or you got something to take up with me? Who knows? Man with two swords and the skill to use them could be very useful these days. Could have sent some underling to fetch me. Could have. But I admit I wanted to see how you'd manage. See if you're as crafty as you are well crafted. See, Witcher? I've got plans. Big plans. Far reaching plans to reshape this city head to toe. Ever thought of seeking a seat on the city council? City council is a puppet troop with the hierarchy of the Church of the Eternal Fire as its puppeteer. Until recently, that is. When Radovid. Is it me or does this guy look like Vinnie Jones? The semblance of power don't interest me. A man with a vision. One day, the so called free city of Novigrad will be truly free. But before that can happen, we got a riddit of superstition farting around about the hallowed essence of the eternal fire. Nonsense for kiddies. Apparently not. Cheering crowd at the execution. Mostly adults. Any crowd around you have to be in the stream for the giveaway? Of burning yes. flesh. Unless you're One saying. day, folk will understand the eternal fire's naught but a leash around their necks. They call this place the Putrid Grove. But it's the best <clears> of Novigrad <throat> that's putrefied. This here's the last bastion of normality, sanity, reason. And even then, you gotta be here when we started. Like found his way to our city, because it will be our city one day, Carol. Mark my words. Yours, plural. Yeah, mine, and me friends. But that's a tale for another time. For now, I'll leave you two alone, because I can see. You clearly need it. <clears throat> Garrett, you guys ever I seen have Snatch? To take care of in town. I'll be I glad have to not. tag along. Okay, have you seen Gone in 60 Seconds? What's your arrangement? Not. He using you? Helping me to survive, actually. Six months ago, if somebody said Triss Marigold would be working, you'll probably for have better luck with that. I never believed it. Six months ago, Triss Marigold parted Oh, dang it! I forgot I was on push to talk. Um, hasn't turned out like I imagined. I've seen the trailers for it. I don't remember if I've seen the movie or not. Let me give you a taste of my life. For Snatch? It was Nicholas? Or no, no, we'll get on in sixty seconds. Oh, you haven't seen Snatch? No. Madam Sorceress, beautiful as ever. Damn shame to part. Don't fret. Bound to be back soon. I take it you're in Navigrad. Where are you at in the arrow? Important doesn't do it justice. So I'm looking four. for someone. More precisely. <laughs> Young woman who's like a daughter to me. Her. Closer yeah. to the end of it, though. No, impossible. <laughs> it's been a few she weeks since here. I watched the last episode of what I watched. I was hoping you'd heard something. You've been here a while. I need you to help me find something, anything, a trace. I'll do everything I can, of course. I guess Who I should be watching more? that instead of playing video games. So I guess I won't play Call of Duty with you tonight. I'll watch Arrow. Watch it <laughs> while you're playing video games. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I can't pay attention to it while I'm playing video games. Especially if I got the stream up too. Too much things to pay attention to. Tris, we've missed you. I've missed you. Well. <laughs> Stands in love with Triss. I am.
Hello, Klug. Managed to get those magic incense ingredients? Yes, somewhat with uh, difficulties, you might say. I was walking along the canal with a sack full of goodies for you. Looked up and spied a trio of temple guards coming the other way. Get to the point, Klug. No time today for one of your long stories. Wait! A sack full of magicalities and they were coming straight towards me. I don't easily frighten, but uh, I felt a cold sweat on my arse, I did. I'm afraid I had no choice. I dropped the sack in the water. I had to! When asked why, I claimed it contained a dead cat. You can't believe this. But that in his missions were at choose, right? Package, Klug. I've got a contract. It must be on the canal bed. Luckily, it was heavy enough to sink. Choose a lot. I'm sure it'll turn out. So you expect me to I'm like right here at the beginning of this mission. Filth? No, you don't choose between them yet. I think. I can do that. Where'd you toss the package? Near the crane. Second bridge in from the harbor. I didn't expect such devotion. Wanted to freshen up anyway. Let's go. Stop. Hear that? They've come for us. The fool didn't break until I began to prick his heel. Every man's got his sensitive spot. Interrogated a mage once. Pain couldn't touch him. Tore off his fingernails, crushed his bollocks. Nothing. Turned out. He was devilishly ticklish. I placed a beetle on his belly and set a mug atop it. Damn you went mad. You were lucky this time, but you'd best leave via the sewers. The trapdoor's in the floor. Take care of yourself, Klug. The very reason so many mages came here after the massacre at Loch Muin thought they'd be safe from Radovid's reapers. Instead, they jumped out of the frying pan into the fire. But Novigrad stands on top of a mountain of coin, and winning a war takes three things. Coin, coin, and even more coin. That's why they're exterminating mages, confiscating their property and possessions. And they'll go after non-humans next. The elves occupy slums, but the dwarves practice. Judging by what Klug said, the parcel should be around here, on the bottom. Unless the poor man was mistaken. He's been forgetful ever since Manga interrogated him. He seems to be suffering from a persecution complex, too. Current must have carried the sack seaward. I'll swim towards the port. Coming with? But maybe some other time. Don't know what you're missing. Water's thick with pungent oils. Guessing it'll do wonders for my complexion. <laughs> Guessing this water will do wonders for my complexion. Yeah, okay. No. Find the parcel? 
Or did you get wet for no reason? Nothing like a refreshing swim in a filthy canal. Found a few fish, a rusty anchor, the carcass of a boat. Oh, and this. Oh, my package. Hope the contents aren't so crude. Oh, you're a doll. I'm a doll. Seem to be I'm a doll. Element. Still remember my elements? How I use them? Come on. Six months isn't that long. It's not like I'm senile. But you do have a history of amnesia. I've recovered my memory completely. Good. That should stop people from taking advantage of you. Someone's been taking advantage of me. I have, for one. I've never even intimated. We need to hurry. She says she's been taking advantage of me. I've never even intimated. Are you running away? Are you giving away a copy of Modern Warfare? No. No. I'm doing a... Tonight, tonight's giveaway will be a $25 game code. Yeah. Greetings, Sorceress. Greetings, Brandon. I didn't expect you to bring company. Told him you're a Sorceress? Triss, you told this man you're a Sorceress? Of course. She was looking for work. That's her chief asset. Are you, Triss? I know it was reckless, but competition's stiff here. No one would hire me if I claimed to be a common rat catcher. More importantly, no one would believe such a beauty could be an exterminator of rodents. But I'd prefer you not to tarry and begin. Triss, you and Brandon here. You've agreed a price. We settled on a full coin purse. Brandon and Co. is a serious outfit. We've the largest granary in all Novigrad. Hey, what's up, Rudolph? Alright. Alright then. Let's get to work. We need to place these crystals around the granary. Near anything that looks rat-related. I'll cover half the space. You take the other half. Look for evidence of rat activity. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. Thing well, is, that's kinda easy. I know what evidence of manticore activity looks like, but rodents? Geralt, we'd both rather be somewhere else. I'd rather be sitting in a royal council meeting, but they killed my king. Look for crevices and droppings. Once we place this incense, what then? I'll cast a spell and the rats will leave. They didn't Can't kill do that king. without sprinkling incense? Don't really feel up to looking for rat shit. Stop whining. Looks like a good spot. I don't like that guy. Brandon? I don't either. He's much too fat. Can't help but agree. But no. Notice how he didn't try to haggle? Must really want the rats out. Triss, he's a merchant. He makes his living by haggling. If I worried about that sort of thing, I'd starve to death in this city. A master monster slayer in the world's largest city. Looking for rat shit. Jeez. <laughs> a master monster slayer? <laughs> in a city that hates freaks looking for rat shit. <laughs> You hate mosquitoes? I hate mosquitoes too. Thankfully though, they, they, they've, they're gone for the winter. Or well, here they're gone for the winter. <clears throat> I'm sure they'll be back in full force here in a few months, but for now they're gone.
well. Now we wait for them to scurry away. Interesting method. Never had much luck with rats. Once I hit one with a fork in complete darkness, trying to show off my witcher's senses. Masterful throw, really. Problem was, no one else saw it. How could they in the dark? <laughs> so, what do you think? Rat catcher. It's a long way to fall from being advisor to Temeria's king. I'm just glad to see you safe and sound, and... Reconciled? Good. There aren't bad feelings between... Are you truly, or just pretending? Knew a man once who reacted to everything, especially adversity, by mocking it. Healthy attitude. Must have lived long. Came a day he lost both his legs in battle. He shrugged, said it was better that way. He'd never feel pain in them again. I understand him perfectly. I know. Thing is, he was lying to himself. I think he just didn't have much of a choice. We'll face the truth. We all lie sometimes, but lying to yourself is running away, whereas there's really nowhere to run. Sometimes you have to escape just to forget. Your friend might have dwelled on his lost legs, but it's not like by grieving he could have grown another pair. So, tell me how Yen's doing? How do you know I found her? You didn't answer my question. How's Yen? Specific. Never mind. I got my answer. Wait, I answered bad? <sighs> well, well. Are lovebirds having themselves a little chat instead of working? The job's done. Geralt, those are... I know who they are, Triss. My friends begged me to notify them if I encountered a mage, sorceress, what have you. Didn't have the heart to refuse. It's a trap, Geralt. This stank from the start. Such a sharp sense of smell. You should have legged it while you had the chance. I don't generally leg it. Here's what I think you should do. Pay up and march your boys out of here while there's still time. Don't be ridiculous. I didn't hire a sorceress in order to pay her. Check my advice, mutant. If it's not your business, stay out of it. Thanks for the advice, but I can't take it. All right, we've talked. Do what you gotta. Just remember, I can't help but get in your way. Heard enough from this poor son. As have I. Neither is to leave here alive. Okay. So we're gonna back it up. I, will kill. I don't think I like how that uh, turned out, actually. Terrible, terrible. What are you doing back in your door? Don't back up again. We gotta see all that again. As the Emperor's spies told him, Ceri had reached Novigrad. A lone attempt to find her in the Norse's largest city would certainly fail. But Geralt had friends he could count on. The Witcher decided to contact Triss Marigold. Come on. You know what sounds good that I haven't had in a while? Pizza. Pizza sounds good. Text on push talk.
Or he's just dead. Yeah, he died. He fell asleep playing Assassin's Creed. Look, I can't go on. Oh. <laughs> then he went to go watch Arrow. Like, Stan's gonna make fun of me forever. I ate pizza yesterday. That wasn't really pizza. Come on, dude. I want some, like, pizza. Like, supreme pizza. Mushrooms, peppers, onions. <sighs> Pepperoni sausage. A little bit of ham. Oh, ho, ho. That's right. Garlic dipped crust. Nope, I want to go back before this. Um, As the Emperor's spies told him, Ceri had beached Novigrad. A lone attempt to find her in the Norse's largest city would certainly fail. Hold on a second. But While Geralt this is loading, had friends he's on. The Witcher decided to contact Triss Marigold. Vandas stalking people again. What did you say? Sorry, I missed it. More cautious than I thought. Yep. Can't get too close.
presence is the front to the eternal fire. <laughs> <laughs> Murder the fire priest. I'm going into bro dude gamer mode. Yo man. Uh you are muted, Stan. In the chat. My bad. Thanks, Rito. It's all text fault. It is all text fault. Mm, no, I went into your onto your computer and I hit the mute button for you. Yeah. I mean it. See, look, he even admits it. Hey, what's up, Friendly? Open up. Friendly! Brad. Who are you and what you want? What's up, little sis? Take a look. What do you see? Yellow eyes. Pair of swords. Mutated kill at me things. Heard this place was a meeting spot for oddities. Heard right. Now the password, get him free. Don't know. Gotta to contribute to the Graves upkeep. Don't know the password. Shark Bates trying to build his tokens up from stealing them from other people. I want to pay. How'd you take a Let nap? And then you're exhausted because you took a nap. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Slept too long, maybe? Yeah, I don't, I don't understand that either. Took a nap and then you're exhausted. Either you slept too long and got too much sleep, or you didn't sleep long enough. What the hell is it? So you had one eye in the comments? It's in Which Good. More and more people come to our secret. Well, you still have time to take a nap. About time we made some. I take a nap now. Choice. Oversleep yes. for playing Call of Duty. Me and my little arm just fine. fine. Without the help of you, it's too late for a nap. It's six thirty. You, well, it's never too help, late for a nap. Uh, I took a nap at one o'clock. I don't know what you're talking about. Who do I spy? <laughs> hey, Tris. See you two know each other. See you two know each other well. I was curious whether you'd managed to find me, Witcher. I still think he looks like Vinnie Jones. No, I was looking for you. Got something to take up with me. Oh. oh. Am I mistaken? Or you got something to take up with me? Who knows? Man with two swords and the skill to use them could be very useful these days. Could have sent some underling to fetch me. Could have, but I admit I wanted to see how you'd manage. See if you're as crafty as you are well crafted. See, Witcher, I've got plans, big plans, far reaching plans to reshape this city head to toe. Ever thought of seeking a seat on the city council? City council is a puppet troop with a hierarchy of the Church of the Eternal Fire as its puppeteer. Until recently, that is, when Radovid and his witch hunters took the reins. The semblance of power don't interest me. What? A man with a vision. One day. The so-called free city of Novigrad will be truly free. But before that can happen, we got a riddit of superstition farting around about the hallowed essence of the eternal fire. Nonsense for kiddies. Apparently not. Cheering crowd at the execution. Mostly adults. Any crowd a rabble will cheer to the stench of burning so flesh. What about but one day, folk will understand the eternal fire's naught but a leash around their necks. They call this place the Putrid Grove, but it's the rest of Novigrad that's putrefied. This year's the last bastion of normality, sanity, reason. I'm actually glad someone like you's found his way to our city, because it will be our city one day, Geralt. 
Mark my words. Yours, plural. Yeah, mine. And me friends. But that's a tale for another time. For now, I'll leave you two alone. Because I can see, well, you clearly need it. <coughs> Gerald, I have a lot of things to take care of in town. I'll be glad to tag along. Sounds like a prick. He is a prick, but... He, he's he's definitely What's your arrangement? He using you? Helping Sorry you about survive, that, Stan. <laughs> Six months ago, if somebody said Trist Marigold would be working for a Novigrad criminal, I'd never have believed it. Six but months Mr. ago, Trist is pretty good. Uh, so is the interview. I had to start a new. Hasn't turned out like I imagined. Come on. Let me give you a taste of my life. But, uh, yeah, he is a prick, but he's the lesser of the two evils when, if you pick him between him and the eternal fire. And right now, the eternal fire doesn't like us, so maybe it can't be too easy. Beautiful, is it? Damn shame to pop. Don't fret. Bound to be back soon. I take it you're a Novigrad on important business. Important doesn't do it justice. I'm looking for someone. More precisely? Young woman who's like a daughter to me. Her? Here? No, impossible. She was here. There are witnesses, evidence. Was hoping you'd heard something. You've been here a while. I need you to help me find something, anything, a trace. I'll do everything I can. Who might know more? Oh, she's got a very fine way of walking. It's the material world. <laughs> I like Driss and all of her assets. Uh, I see what she did there. Luke, managed to get those magic incense ingredients? Yes, somewhat with uh, difficulties, you might say. I was walking along the canal with a sack full of goodies for you. Looked up and spied a trio of temple guards coming the other way. Get to the point, Klug. No time today for one of your long stories. Wait! A sack full of magicalities and they were coming straight towards me. I don't easily frighten, but uh, I felt a cold sweat on my arse, I did. I'm afraid I had no choice. I dropped the sack in the water. I had to. He got a cold when sweat on his ass. Claimed it contained a dead cat. You can't believe this. But they believe me. I need that package, Klug. I've got a contract. It must be on the canal bed. Luckily, it was heavy enough to sink. I'm sure answer. it'll turn up if you search. You expect me to pay you, then die for my goods into that ice cold filth? I can do that. Where'd you toss the package? Near the crane. Second bridge in from the harbor. I didn't expect such devotion. Wanted to freshen up anyway. Let's go. Stop. Hear that? They've come for us. The fool didn't break until I began to prick his heels. Every man's got his sensitive spots. Interrogated uh, so a major. Pain couldn't touch him. Tore off his fingernails. No mean Chinese Nothing. Turned out. He was devilishly ticklish. I placed a beetle on his belly and set a mug atop it. Is nobody bringing you any food? Yeah, went bad. We were lucky this time, but you'd best leave via the sewers. The trapdoor's in the floor. Take care of yourself, Clue. Mr. Stand on that bringing you nothing. Got a
an exit here. Klug wouldn't have sent us here if there wasn't. There must be a lever on this wall that'll open the secret passage. Free city of Novograd. You know, masters, yes. The very reason so many Definitely. ages came here after the massacre at Loch Muin. Thought they'd be safe from Radovid's Reapers. Instead, they jumped out of the frying pan. Sure, so really fire. This place. But Novigrad stands on top of a mountain. Last time I did coin, And winning a war takes three things coin, coin, and even more coin. That's why even though I thought Triss was pretty. Confiscating the property and possessions. And they'll go after non humans next. But I didn't the know the background between him and Triss. The war is practically controlled financial life in the city. Now, with more context. Novigrad will remain neutral. Somehow, doubt anyone believes that anymore. Jennifer is the love. Of the main novels, but judging by what Kim Trismore the should be around here on the bottom, unless the poor man was mistaken. He's been forgetful ever since Manga interrogated him. Seems to be suffering from a persecution complex too. Current Matter of fact, that's why we reloaded. Um, I'll swim towards the. She asks us a question about Jennifer. Give her some uh, other time. Don't know what you're missing. Water's thick with pungent oils. Guessing it'll do wonders for my complexion. I gave her an answer. She didn't seem very happy with it. I don't think there was any answer she would be happy with, but we're gonna retry it anyway. Oh, you haven't. Oh, you reloaded? Yep. Oh, you haven't talked, had the conversation again yet? Nope. Where'd it go? Oh, see, it didn't go back pretty far. Yeah. Did you not save or something? I did, but... <sighs> the save I had, one of the saves I had was... Um, too close. There was something else I wanted to change. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Like getting money from the rat bastard before we go in there. <laughs> Find the parcel? Or did you get wet for no reason? Nothing like a refreshing swim in the filthy canal. Found a few fish, a rusty anchor, the carcass of a boat. Oh, and this. Hope the contents aren't soaked through. Oh, you're a doll. Doll? Seem to be in your element. Still remember my elements? How I used them? Come on, six months isn't that long. It's not like I'm senile. But you do have a history of amnesia. I've recovered my memory completely. Good. That should stop people from taking advantage of you. Someone's been taking advantage of me. I have, for one. I've never even intimated. We need to hurry. This rat bastard. Greetings, sorceress. Name Greetings, fits too. You'll see why her name. I didn't expect you to bring company. What are you a sorceress? Triss, you told this man you're a sorceress? Of course. She was looking for work. That's her chief asset. Are you Triss? I know it was reckless, but competition's stiff here. No one would hire me if I claimed to be a common rat catcher. More importantly, no one would believe such a beauty could be an exterminator of rodents. But I'd prefer you not to tarry and begin. Triss, you and Brandon here. You've agreed a price. We settled on a full coin purse. Brandon and Co. is a serious outfit. We've the largest granary in or Novigrad. Don't much like merchants who flatter with cheap praise before the job's done. That was not cheap praise. I was merely stating a fact. So am I. I want you to pay in full in advance. I'm afraid that's impossible. Then trap your own rats. 
Well, now I know why she brought you along. Fine, a full purse of Novigrad crowns. There's proof of my goodwill. We need to place these crystals around the granary, near anything that looks rat-related. I'll cover half the space. You take the other half. Look for evidence of rat activity. Mm -hmm. Thing is, I know what evidence of manticore activity looks like, but rodents? Geralt, we'd both rather be somewhere else. I'd rather be sitting in a royal council meeting, but they killed my king. Look for crevices and droppings. Once we place this incense, what then? I'll cast a spell and the rats will leave. Can't do that without sprinkling incense? Don't really feel up to looking for rat shit. Stop whining. Gotta <laughs> look for that rat shit. Stop whining. Looks like a good spot. I don't like that guy. Brandon? I don't either. He's much too fat. Can't help but agree. But no. Notice how he didn't try to haggle? Must really want the rats out. Triss, he's a merchant. He makes his living by haggling. If I worried about that sort of thing, I'd starve to death in this city. every hole in there. All right. Get ready for some magic fireworks. Once I activate the incense, I have a moment to talk. All right. More fireworks. Well. All right, this is the conversation. Now we wait for them to scurry away. Interesting method. Never had much luck with rats. Once I hit one with a fork in complete darkness, trying to show off my witcher's senses. Did Master you quick throw really. before the conversation? Problem was no yeah. one else saw it. How could they in the dark? <laughs> uh, not very full so what do you yeah. think, rat catcher? Why not? It's a long way to fall from being advisor to Tamaria's king. I'm just glad to see you safe and sound. She gives me the same response. I'll know that there's nothing reconciled. There. Nothing that'll that she'll like, basically. Knew a man once who reacted to everything, especially adversity, by mocking it. Healthy attitude. Must have lived long. Came a day he lost both his legs in battle. He shrugged, said it was better that way. He'd never feel pain in them again. I understand him perfectly. I know. Thing is, he was lying to himself. I think he just didn't have much of a choice. You could be right, but only he knows the truth. We're only ever the ones to know the truth about ourselves. Which we share at times with those we hold dear. Even if it's hard to swallow? Even then. Who knows? Maybe one day. So... Tell me how Yen's doing. How do you know I found her? You didn't answer my question. How's Yen? Not bad. Asking about anything specific? Never mind. I got my answer. The same response, so I don't know. Yeah. The same response? Yep, same response. Well, well. Are lovebirds having themselves a little chat instead of working? The job's so done. We redid that for nothing. Yeah, those are. It. I know who they are, Triss. My friends begged me to notify them if I so am a mage. What's up, Jesus? What have you? Didn't have the Hey, Morris, what's going on, man? It's a trap, Geralt. This stank from the start. If those are always going to help us kill rats, son? they're late. No. You paid up front and got what you paid for. Not half a rodent left in the granary. I paid in advance because I knew I'd recover my coin. 
Such is life for sorceresses in Novigrad these days. I can see that, and I don't like it. So here's what I think. The hunters have come, and now they can go. They'll do no such thing. All right, we've talked. Do what you gotta. Just remember, I can't help but get in your way. Heard enough from this poor son. As have I. Neither is to leave here alive. Stando got food now. Sort of. Hey, what's up, Ozzy? Yeah, you doing? Don't kill me. Good sir, no. They forced me. Had I not told them, they'd have set fire to my home, my warehouse. The mage hunters know no mercy. Spare me, good man. Be not like those murderers. Shut up. I should kill you. Thing is, you'd be no good to anyone but the gulls as a corpse. So you'll live and pay us double. Now. Fine. Your coin. Now, get. Thanks, Geralt. No need. No need. Glad I could help. You know, I've been thinking who might know something about Siri. And I just got an idea. There's an Oniromancer in town, Kareem Tilly. Very capable, supposedly. Never trusted in Dreamer's abilities Be a myself. Boston Street champion? Kareem's been very effective. It's a bit you hard. should at least try. She's taken a job close by. Follow the canal, away from the fish market. The house is near the first bridge. Its owner, Dijon Kier, is a rich banker. Not coming with me? I've got some things to take care of. Another rat-infested warehouse? Not exactly. Nothing even remotely satisfying. Such are the times. It was nice to see you again. You too, Geralt. You should go now. Before Kareen goes back into hiding somewhere. What if I want to find you? I live in the bits, near the fish market. Stop by. It'll be nice. All right. See you later. Tell me to stop by. <laughs> That'll work. That'll work. That'll work. Just passing by, wanderer? Or do you seek something specific? Who's asking? Rudolf de Jonkier. Of those de Jonkiers, yes. My ancestors laid the foundations of this city. I now own its largest bank. Didn't need a recommendation. Name would have been enough. 
Father always said, all ought to know your merit, son. Don't hide them under a bushel. Looking for Kareem? I'm looking for Kareem Tilly. Well, you've come to the right place, then. Kareem is inside. Been there for a few days, dreaming the home's history. Now, sister, why can't you care about it? Why do you need to know the house's history? You a historian or on a whim? I bought this property a short while ago. Paid a pretty penny, I might add. Soon after, I witnessed disturbances. It led me to fear the home might be haunted. What are the symptoms? Oh, they vary. Giggling in the night. And furniture moving about in the attic. And last week... Well, you shan't believe it. I found human feces in the planet. Why are you standing here? Not interested in what's going on inside? Seeing it for yourself? I'm a banker. Cursed homes scare me. Do you know how a haunting can affect property value? Point of fact, Corinne requested she not be disturbed. I'd like to go inside, look around. I don't usually let strangers rummage around my home. Twin swords, though. You're a witcher. You may enter, call that my whim. The truth is, we're already dependent on the black ones, economically. It's another godling. Anyway, hold up just a second, guys.
Sorry, guys. But a small bowl of macaroni wasn't going to do it for me. Is that what they brought you? Yeah. So I went and got me in a hot pocket and some more macaroni. <laughs> Told y'all I was hungry. Gotta let my hot pocket cool off though. Alright. Let's go. Clearly, you need to eat those uh, lean pockets. <clears throat> wow, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Dang, shark bait. And here Stan's been thinking he's been losing weight or something. <laughs> I'm just joking. Oh, man. All right, hurt. Right. Those were your friends, weren't uh, weren't they, that I had to time out earlier? Tech, I don't have friends. What are you talking about? I'm not surprised. Oh, so we're not friends now? Jeez. <clears throat> that hole's just getting deeper and deeper. Put it down, please. That's blood. Don't spill it. Please. What happened, Tech? I got killed. Ah! One don't you? Uh, I never don't get killed. It's all your fault. Because you don't have any friends. Wake up. It's just a dream. Wake up. Is she waking up, coming to, or is she in a trance? The doll. More of a trance thing. That's what? probably why Shark Bait hangs out with us because he doesn't have any friends. So he's like, well, I may as well. I am Shark Bait's these. friend. He's like, I may as well hang out with these I'm losers. Check the attic. Stop. <laughs> Go away. Stinks. Leave it. I don't have anybody else better to hang out with. <laughs> I don't blame you, uh, uh, Sharkbait. I wouldn't want to hang out with me either. <laughs> Put it down, please. Blood. Don't spill. Wait a minute. Please. You do want to hang out with me? Dang it! I don't. I, that didn't make sense. What I just said. I do. No, uh, Sharkbait. I said, uh, I told Sharkbait, I don't blame you, Sharkbait. I wouldn't want to hang out with me either. But then it was, it was like, wait a minute. He Stop. does want to hang out. Go away. Does he? So that didn't make sense. Well, I don't know. Maybe he's here just hanging out with me. <laughs> it's okay, with me. You're a piggy bank. Oh, that's all I'm good for. I see. Yes. All right, now I'm getting some kills. This crib has been hastily drawn by a child, it seems. Damn it. There was a cradle on the second floor. Wonder what would happen if I laid a doll in it. Put it down, please. That's blood. Don't spill it. Please.
another masterpiece, an oven and a blackened grate. Oh joy, a riddle. Guess I should find an oven. Hey Steins Gat, what's going on dude? Well, it's going pretty good so far. scare someone so bad they'll hurt you. Why would someone hurt me? Having this spot of fun's not allowed anymore. What are you playing? That lady fell asleep, and I've sent her some horrible dreams. I'll not her wake neither. I can do that, you know. Funny, isn't it? Very funny. Thing is, I gotta talk to the dreamer, so I'd like you to let her wake up. Little Sarah doesn't want her to wake. Little Sarah wants to play. <sighs> I know what you are. You're lucky. I know you're a harmless godling, but others might not know, and then... And how'd you know I'm a godling, eh? How's that, eh? Eh? If it looks like one and acts like one, trust me, you're a godling. You give the dreamer nightmares and won't let her wake up. Why are you tormenting her? I'm not tormenting anyone. Scary dreams are great. What I love is when this big hen chases me. Hen's got these red. Why do you live in a haunted house? Tell you the secret. <laughs> house not the haunted. House ain't haunted. Not one bit. I just pretend it is. Make everyone think that. It was sitting there all empty. So I moved in. Bigwig from the bank then came and bought it. I don't like bankers. Especially not to live with. So I decided to give him a scare gave the banker a really big scare. See, he paid a lot for this house and won't give it up easily, which is why you need to find another home. I don't want to! I don't! I won't! Let's make a deal. Sarah, Novigrad's no place for a godling. But if you want to live here, that's your business. So let's make a deal. A deal? What kind? <sighs> Leave the dreamer alone. In exchange... I'll tell the banker the house is haunted. For good, no way to lift the curse. You tell him that? What if he doesn't believe you? I'm a witcher. He'll believe me. Yes? 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 Now you remember this quest? And I promise not to bother your friend. Not even a little. You're awfully nice, you know. I don't hear that often. Thanks. Now go wake that sleepyhead. I won't stop her. She'll get up. Yeah, the godlings are cute. Like Johnny. <laughs> Johnny of the woods. Hey, what's up, lady? Who are you? Triss Marigold sent me to see you. Gods. Horrible nightmares. I was supposed to dream the history of this house. Instead, I saw furniture. Hungry furniture that wished to devour me. I know it must sound foolish. But in the dream... Well, it was all too real. And not at all amusing. The work of a godling. She made people believe the house was haunted. Also injected your dreams with her little jokes. 
And you managed to wake me. I feel fortunate. We witchers have our ways. I thank you very much. The dreams, they were awful. Any way I can pay you back? There is, actually. I'm looking for a young woman who was seen in Novigrad. I can certainly try to help. But I'll need to clear my head first. After those deranged dreams, I feel it's full of cobwebs. Find me at the Golden Sturgeon. I rent a room there. All right. See you there. <laughs> I just want to remind you, Sharp Bait, that the closer to 40 you get, buddy, things start protruding. Like a gut. It can't be helped. So the solution is don't hit 40. Got it. Yep. I saw Miss Corrine leave, but she refused to speak to me. Is the matter resolved? Or quite the opposite? Actually, don't hit 30. How old are you? Because it really happens overnight at 30. A bit of both. A demon had captured Corrine. I managed to free her, but the house is still haunted. Did Corrine dream of the building's past? Yeah. Pretty horrid, apparently. Though she refused to talk about it. Nobody should inhabit the place. So many crowns I paid! Oh, well. It shall put me in the poorhouse. Truth is, we're already dependent on the Black Bubbles. Economically. I'm going to meet her at the Golden Sturgeon. So, to the Golden Sturgeon, where you go. Look at all the rats running in a line. Yep. That's from uh, when you did the quest with Chris. Oh, is that the same line of rats? Yes. Looking for a new home, huh? First achieve a kind of mental accord. I must ask some questions. You must answer them. It's important you're truthful. Answer from your heart. Dreaming, what's it about? Your gift. Tell me how it works. It's hard to describe. To start with, I must gain an understanding of the bond between the person and the object I'm to dream about. I ask questions. Do you notice the, uh, feelings, emotions. Oh, when? Can I have a piece and give cards that? Yes. And though most who come to me acknowledge that, many refuse to speak openly of certain matters. Um. Apart from which, they remain unaware of others, further obscuring things. What do you see in your dreams? I don't. It's my client who sees. My gift lies in summoning the right dreams. At times, nightmares or strong desires impose themselves on true events. It takes skill to separate seed from chaff. Sure, mate. What? Did you notice the jiggle physics in this game? They're amazing. <laughs> Very interesting. <laughs> Let's begin. To start with, tell me a memory you have of this woman. What for? Do as I ask, please. I need the strongest, most complete memory you have of... 
Siri. The woman's name is Siri. Remember when we first met? I accepted a job once. Did it. Asked to choose my reward, I invoked the law of surprise. Never thought I'd actually meet the child promised to me at that time. Years later, I was in the Broccolon Forest. Happened on a girl there, didn't know who she was. The Dryads wanted to keep her, turn her into one of their own. But the Waters of Oblivion, they failed in her case. Siri came out of Broccolon with me. I sent her back to her grandmother then. But already, I felt bound to her. By destiny. By something more. Thank you. Would you be willing to share another memory? Yes. Yes. No need to rush. We have time. I never care more. Siri was orphaned during the Second War with Nilfgaard. I had no idea what to do with a young girl. So I did what I would have done with a boy and took her to Kaer Morin. Figured some physical training, sword work, development of her stamina, couldn't hurt. I remember her standing on a crumbling wall. A stone came loose, she lost her footing. Caught her at the last possible instant. Strongest memory, though, is of her coming out of her room one day. Wearing a dress and claiming she was indisposed. Knew then that Siri was maturing. It was unavoidable. I was lost in the face of that. I see. Do you wish to tell me anything more? Side quests are not boring, right? No. No, 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 no. Not in this game. You know, pretty much everything we've done today, except for Triss, has been side questing. Yes, I think so. In that case, I'm listening. Save your life once. It was after her time training at Kaer Morhen. After the moment when Yennefer first called Ciri her daughter. We've been separated. I knew she was in danger. I dreamt of her multiple times. I found her at Stiga Castle. She'd gone there to free Yen and gotten herself captured in the process. They wanted to hurt her. I remember fighting side by side with Ciri on stairs slippery from blood. It was the first time she ever deflected a crossbow bolt with her sword. Told her never to try it again. These memories, they're intense. Do you wish to continue? I have more to say. Then please do. It was in Rivia. The second war with Nilfgaard had just ended. There was still tension in the air. For gods know what reason race riots erupted in the town. I tried to do something, but couldn't stop a riled crowd. A boy with a pitchfork. He ran it right through my gut. Jennifer lay dying as well. Siri had us carried onto a boat. We sailed to a place where apple trees bloom eternal. She left us there. That was the last time I saw her. You claim the woman has abilities. Tell me about them. Siri is a child of the Underwood. She's a child of the Elder Blood. A descendant of Bloody Falker. The rebel burned at the stake. The prophecies claim the world's destroyer will be born of the Firebrand's cursed blood. Pure legend. No one a legend transforms into prophecy. When it gains believers. I think you're right to be reticent in talking about the woman. I see. Do you wish to say more? Yes. Yeah. There's something else. They call her the Lady of Space and Time. They call mm. Siri the Lady of Space it's and so Time. It's so kind that I am glad that I was Once I asked Yennefer yeah. why, she... There's a difference between side questing... Travels between worlds... And side activities. Side activities... <laughs> Turns out I not know how to talk more. about it. Didn't really understand much of what Yen told Never me. More. I just know there's more to it than traveling to different places. And that Siri carries immense power in her blood. What? You don't want to fetch like 50 billion me? things across the world? No. <laughs> yeah, there's something else. 
Me and Shark Bay like to do that. I remember Siri having trouble controlling her abilities. Jennifer tried to teach her to cast simple spells, and Siri destroyed a she ship sure to where they were. But now I'm not really a fan of Flex the Thongs either. I know it took her a while to gain control. And frankly, I doubt she controls her abilities fully to this day. I see. What? Shark Bait you to betrayed me. No. Can we start? Naturally. I knew you cared about her. But your tone, the emotions you so carefully conceal. Let's continue. Like all the Riddler Make trophies in uh, Batman, I never end up getting you all of them. my hand. And turn uh, I'm me either. I've never Tell gotten all the real trophies. Who could be at her side? Mm -hmm. How could you do that? If Siri couldn't find me, I'm sure she would have looked for another friend. Who do you mean? Yennefer wasn't in Novigrad. Triss was. But Siri never found her. Maybe Dandelion? They liked each other a lot. line in this game really does look like a dandy. What's Batman? <sighs> Dreamt of a swallow at first. After that, just nightmares. At times, the dreams can multiply. Show the past as well as the future. The swallow. That one was hard for me to finish. She contacted Dandelion. My least favorite of the whole franchise. The poet heard about him. Someone left him the rosemary and thyme in their will. The rosemary and thyme? Where's that? As you enter the city through the red light district, you come upon a bridge. The rosemary is just past it. Dandelion inherited a brothel? So I've heard. Thanks for your help. Good luck, Witcher. I hope you find your Siri. I did. I heard a door open. Because I am a hand. So it's probably normal. Yeah. But I just heard a door open. Well, yeah, there's people coming and going. Stinking scatters. Owes me one. Zoltan's running it with him. Yo. Time I'll rip your fucking legs off and shove them up your ass till you've toes for teeth.
Gear up in the nick of time, as always. Zoltan, with your boot to someone's ass, as always. Who were those men? Local color. He yep. wasn't going more than a moment. Long enough for them to turn our home into theirs. All right, time for some spring cleaning. I've got to boot them all out. Here to join me? With pleasure. Kick some asses. Ah, oh, please, that went well. Now we can greet each other like the gods of doom. Aging. I guess Mohawk. Hey, Zoltan, you look good. Training plenty lately. Oh, is that your buddy? What with the war on? No, my hackerman needs to be found, but Redanian laggers standing in just. Do you like always have a Mohawk? You, though, you've weathered a bit. So yeah, but it actually Indian. looks good in this game. No, no, I was asking if he always had one. <sighs> Got some problems. Rather not Did he always you. have a Fuck off, Mohawk? Fuck well, I don't Need know. Need to spill your guts to me now. I don't remember. I mean, in the first two games, did he? You don't remember? I'm trying to listen to him. Sorry. That's a few things. A big guess. Chris? Yennefer, by chance? Tris and I talked, cleared some things up. As for Yennefer, well... So you found her? Ha! Need to tell me all about it. I will. Some other time. Got something a tinge more important to take care of now. Meaning? I'm looking for Siri. I know she came to Novigrad. Might still be here. You mean she's come back? I'll be damned. I wonder if I'd recognize her. How many years is it now? Six? Seven? But what'd she be doing here? Hiding, probably. She might be in danger. See her in your dreams? A couple times. I think he has had her no and the wild dreams. hunt. Oh, not good. Not at all, but I know she came here and contacted Dandelion. <sighs> we have a wee problem then. Where's Dandelion? Where's Dandelion? <laughs> I'd like to know that myself. Maybe he can explain what the hell's going on. Not just barely returned as you saw. Expecting to come home to your hut like a boar in some cold ale. What do you find instead? A shite storm. Dandelion gone. The tavern chock full of bums. Have no clue what happened. Mm. Let's look around. Might find something that'll put us on his trail. Prime idea. I say we start on the ground floor. It's where he sat for. Dry, five cases of sodden triple mead. Hmm, nothing here. No, 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 that's exactly what we're looking for. It says planner. It's starting to look like a man serious about his business. Seems Dandelion's taking the tavern business seriously. If you only knew, gives it everything. No seen him this obsessed ever. Seems when he inherited this fine establishment, it came with some fine responsibilities. Bookkeeping among them. He also made a habit of noting down the times of his meetings, official and private. So, who'd he been seeing of late? Ah, here it is. Hmm. Seems he's only been meeting women of late. The dog. I could help. Hmm. Not a bad idea. Dandelion's pretty loose-lipped. Might have blabbed something to a lady friend that'll put us on his trail. That's what I'm counting on. 
Hmm. We should divide these somehow. Perhaps. Ah, fuck it. <laughs> I'll ask the lasses in my half, you interrogate the ones in yours. Such a. Zoltan, wait. This is in verse. And you figure that's unnatural because. Wonderful. Meet me back here when you're done. Share our findings. Right, you are. Need to do a wee bit of tidying for a go. Cannot stomach the idea of coming back to this mess. And you'd be wise to read your bit before you scurry off. If you need anything, fire, uh, it'll be next door. Our door's always Scottish. Or Irish. Irish. Wow. Why are doors always Irish? Tech, go ahead. I have no idea. Maybe they're all born in Ireland? I don't know. Maybe. Must be the love of alcohol. Maybe. I can see that too. Go do the fist fighting. Well. Or just uh, run around and pick up every quest inside the, the, the city. The fist fighting is level 23, though. No, the level 11 one. Oh, is there a level 11 fist fight? Actually, I was hoping to meet up with Triss before I got off here, but apparently we're still doing the search for Dandelion. Is that your favorite character or something? Ooh. Dandelion. No. <laughs> the way you said it, and you're like, the search for Dandelion, like, best character ever. That's what sarcasm sounds like, too. Yeah, I know. Do you really, though? Yeah. Do you really, though? Yeah. Which one's closest to me? What were we talking about that you're asking if I, whatever you were asking me? Um, <laughs> are, are you getting that you were on? saying, do you really? I wasn't really paying attention to us because I was playing Call of Duty at the same time. So I was just like answering mindlessly. Do you really understand card sarcasm? Oh, hard. Oh, yeah, that's right. Now I remember. Yes, I do. Hard sarcasm? What's the difference between hard sarcasm and sarcasm? sarcasm. Oh, yeah, I know what sarcasm is. He's still not paying attention. We have interest. Give me a week, please. You gotta Boston's remember, Tech has a uh, brain the size an of an atom. You pay hey. time, you get protection. You don't pay. I resent that. Help! I mean, what resemble that? No, I resent that. Wench. What are you hoping for? A knight in shining armor? No, you definitely resent that. Hey, no. Too bad, he's grayhead. Not your concern. I'm smarter than you look. This spew has got someone else's Just I'm sometimes a little slow. Really? Who's that be? Analyzing the situation. 
mine offered her a better rate. I analyzed everything I right. analyzed. So, let's see if you're a good bargain or just cheap shit. wrong i'm grateful but everything i had i just lost relax it'll come out in the wash of course it will just got to soak it in white vinegar but that's not my point junior shan't forgive me Either I'll close up shop myself, or he'll burn me down. Sorry, didn't think about that. A woman's lot. Men have their fun, and we're stuck with a mess. Oh, well, I suppose I must move to Oxenfurt. Professors need clean undergarments, too. Don't know if you remember. We've met. I don't... Wait... Wait, I know you. You're that witcher I near clobbered with a vase when... Well... When you kicked Dandelion out, through the balcony. Actually, he's the reason I'm here. Know where he is? Probably out whoring, that horse pheasant. That lion scoundrel. Ouch. What did he do to get your goat? Same thing as ever. Prize bullshitter came back, saying it was till death do we part this time. And... No more than a week passed before I spotted him in Harborside, strolling with some troll upon his arm. It was the last straw. All those questions about the washerwomen at the bathhouse, then this. I beat him black and blue and threw him out on his ear. <coughs> Dandelion asked you about other washerwomen? Dandelion asked you about other washerwomen? Not terribly subtle, even for him. Maybe he likes some sudsy. Ah. Uh. Maybe. But what did he ask about, exactly? Well, this and that, really. What's it like at the bathhouse? Have I got any friends there? What are their working hours? I don't know. Maybe he's looking to hire one for his tavern. Maybe I got all in a huff for no reason. Who was he with uh, in the harbour, sir? This woman he was with in the harbour. Who was she? Claimed she was his niece from Covia. Ha! <laughs> Horvia, more likely. Course it so tight her eyes were popping out her head. His too, come to think of it. An artist or a whore doesn't much matter as they're one in the same. Seriously. Thanks for your help. Listen, when I find Dandelion, anything I should tell him? No. I mean, tell him he's a two faced snake, but it would be nice if he dropped by. He's a two-faced snake, but it would be nice if he dropped by. Uh, I need some more between my legs. That's what she's saying. I'm a friend of Dandelion's, looking for Elial. You've come to the right spot. How might I be of service? Need something shortened? Patch your trousers, darn your socks. You, Elial? Yes. Now pick your jaw up off the floor. Sorry, I thought. Thought Elial was one of Dandelion's girlfriends. Ah, oh, so it's that. Wait here. comes back in a dress. 
Any better? So you're... Elihow. Did you and Dandelion... I mean... How did you two meet? I met him one night in a tavern. He was blind drunk. <laughs> Don't want another rest. Don't think I want to know what happened next. Oh, stop. He wasn't so drunk as not to figure it out. Besides, men don't interest me. I told him that from the start. I assume it. Luckily, Dandelion's an open-minded fellow. We had a lovely evening. He became a loyal customer afterwards. Why do you dress that way? I know this is none of my business, but why do you... Why do I dress up? As a child, I dreamt of becoming a Doppler when I grew up. I became a tailor instead. Discovered clothing. Costumes can express all the complexities of one's personality. I'm a Redanian countess one day, a Doxite thug the next. That is true freedom. Mm -hmm. Have you never thought to become someone else? Even for a moment? Must be horribly boring being a witcher all the time. I managed to stay interested. What did you and Dandelion talk about? What did you and Dandelion talk about? He asked about anything in particular? Hmm, let me think. Had an ordinary chat, really. Although, indeed, he did keep asking about Kalkstein. If Dandelion and I hadn't laid our cards on the table at the start, I might have suspected he had a history with the alchemist. He spoke like a lovesick beau. In fact, he desperately wished to meet with him. Kalkstein's in Novigrad? Wouldn't mind seeing him myself. You're too late, I fear. The witch hunters nabbed him recently, burned him at the stake in Hierarch Square. But as he perished, ooh, the goings on, impressive. Fiery beasts circled his pyre, then rose into the sky and exploded to form letters. Really? What did they spell? Radovid sucks flaccid cock. <laughs> he had the fireworks blow up to say Radovid. Radovid sucks flaccid cock. That's hilarious. Dandelion visit your shop often? I tried many times to talk him into a decent doublet. Sadly, he'd only come in to get a button reaffixed or a hole patched. When did you last see him? Some time ago. He brought in one of Zoltan's jerkins, insisted I sew on an extra pocket. Odd as requests go, I had the distinct feeling he'd actually come to talk. Thanks for your help, and uh, nice to meet you. I can help with much more. If you need new trousers or a vest, you know where to find me. Your bones are aching again. You know, I can pretend to be as open-minded, but there's still th some things that make me cringe. <laughs> Nothing doing. Something reeks. I, like I, I don't care. Gay, gay guys don't bother me. Gay girls don't bother me. But some men make ugly women, and the cross dressing is. Ooh. Just makes me shudder. I know I shouldn't be that way, but. I can't help it. It's the orphans! Excuse me, I'm looking for Marabella. I am she. Wait outside, class is in session. Is it the same kids? It won't take long. From the bog? 
It turns out he'll not You're come back. You're like my grandma. Why not? A rat bit him, and he's caught a fever. Where'd he get bit? It hurt him much. Will he die? Don't die for rats, stupid. Yes, you do. Just the other day I saw a witch hunter tell a man, you rat, and then he killed him. Liar. That's enough. We're done for the day. Gather your things and go home. La, la, la. Wonder if the rat patch will get well. Like as not. How do you know? Mum says that if he but catches a cough, he's as good as in the grave. This one's got him. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a witcher by the toe. If he sees you, let him go. Run away and go Mom? slow. Where are you? Are you along the path? What now? Leave me be. Yeah. Right, then. Now can we talk? Yes. What do you want? I know you saw Dandelion recently. Oh yes. Longest afternoon of my life. He read you his poems? No. He perused the illustrated guide to fungi. Hmm. Maybe... No. Won't even try to guess why he wanted to do that. Mold. That was his interest. When his hand abandoned my knee to point at a figure of penicillium, I knew the fire between us had died. Permanently. See him later? See Dandelion after the fungus incident? No. I even considered granting him another chance. His heart of hearts is pure gold. He simply needs a bit more discipline in his life. But he never came back to see me. So I thought if it's done, it's done. Thanks for your help. Farewell. Man, that dandelion though. Hey! What's he up to? Hey, hey, Lynn's down for what's up, dude? Over here, real quick. Let me just start wrapping this up. This Baronet's love of Let's Villa. Shouldn't interest you. The Baroness don't mingle with just anyone. Don't worry. I'm here to see your chambermaid, Molly. Out of the way. Baroness is riding now. Be gone. Greetings, Witcher. Must admit it's curious to see you here. I don't quite believe in coincidences. Geralt of Rivia, slayer of monsters, and my son. You're right, oh, General. Yeah. My visit's no accident. I'm looking for someone. There's no one here who wishes to see you. Captain, this man is not to enter. Forgive me, Morvran, but I've lost my appetite for the races. How'd she get Kill out of the prison? Kill a son and appear at her doorstep. My, my. I thought witches had better survival skills than that. Looking for a girl named Molly. Heard she works here. Last time we saw her, information's out she was in, uh, Voltus' no prison works in Witcher 2. seem to know who Molly is. You also know she doesn't work here anymore. Know where I can find her, maybe? This time of day? Probably sipping punch and considering which horse to bet on. Not in the mood for jokes. I jest you not. After Arian's demise, Luis's nephew came to pay his respects. Got one clunts of Molly and, well, they wed soon after. They now await his inheritance. With the Paranus's son dead, the estate will go to the nephew and Lady Lata, known until recently simply as Molly. Leave that cat on. 
Y'all come in here all the time, mess with that cat, and she always ends up back in here. Leave her alone. When she's ready to go out, she goes and sits at the door and waits for me to let her out. Tech, are you sleeping? I'm still here. I'm Dead silent there? there? Uh, I think it's on your end. Sure, no problem. <laughs> Gotta wonder if Molly fell for the nephew or his inheritance. We kind of ready for some Call of Duty thing. But either way, just she Think has strong it. feelings for both. So where will I find the newly minted Lady Latar? Our dear little <clears throat> Molly has a new passion, horse racing. To my knowledge, she should be at Countess Vagelbud's villa right now. That's exactly where I'm going. Since you stripped me of Louise's company, perhaps you'd agree to come along. Have a good Well, if Molly will be there. On our way, then. Yeah, I was hoping to wrap this mission up before the stream ended, but, or not before the stream ended, but before we switched games, but, uh, yeah. How much, uh, more does the, does it have? I don't know. It just keeps going and going yeah. and going. Yeah. It doesn't end. Hey, well, it is the main quest, so it will take a while to finish. Wait, they're doing races at night? We arrived. Nice place. I must say, of all the creatures in this region, I find mm. steeds most intriguing. Horses interest you at all, Witcher? All the same to me. Call each one I ride Roach. Strange. The gray is Cantarella, sired see? by Cantarella. He calls every Jack horse he rides Roach. Yeah. Did you see that? Gray's a good color. Did you hear that? It even looks good on horses. Yeah. yeah. My coins on the black stallion. Named after Never. that stupid Roach guy. Stock. I'm surprised <laughs> he didn't salute you, General. No, I don't I don't know if it actually is or not. It isn't. <laughs> I'm not sure about the others. Know anything about the chestnut or the bay? The chestnut is Thunderbolt, a pure blood Retanian, gallant steed, but too headstrong for my taste, and difficult to control. <coughs> and Ray hails from Zericania. Lord de Volta acquired him recently. I know little about him, though Zericanians are reputed to have incredible stamina. Seem to know your horses. I find them to be far more honest than men. Must say, that guy looks I'm curious like how you manage like in the south of stuck up or something. Mostly just try to stay in it. What would you say to a little race? Not what I came here for. Don't make me beg, Witcher. Tell you what, win, and I shall give you my finest saddle. Made in Nilfgaard proper of beautifully tanned leather. Hmm. Why not? Wouldn't mind seeing if your knowledge of horses <coughs> translates into riding skills. <laughs> Splendid! In that case, you must choose a mount. Think I'll give you a run on the Zeracanian Bay. Cantarella for me, then. The horses are saddled. Let's begin. Said that they're known for their stamina, so going with that. <coughs> ready. 
Move it. Come on. Oh, block me, bitch. Remember, when you slow down and you get low on stamina, remember to body block him. Find all the speed, the rush of air. Oh, shit. Get him. Come on, Witcher. Let's see what you're made of. Did I win? I think I lost. But barely. The roach I chose put in a nice run. Exceptional. I've not lost the race in a while. I congratulate you. That I did is win. yours. Ah, look! Lady Latar has just arrived. Who? The woman formerly known as Molly. There she stands. Right. Thanks. I shall be here for a time. Find me if you'd like to ride back to the city together. She's up there brushing her hair. What do you favor, my lady? Can't decide between the black stallion and the gray mare. Keep going back and forth, back and forth. Sorry, don't believe we've been introduced. I'm Geralt. Geralt? That Geralt? The one Dandelion's rescued time and time again? Huh. Yeah, if not for him. Mm hmm. Wouldn't be here if not for Dandelion. Told me all about your adventures. How he'd ready you for battle with his songs. <sighs> How he tamed the Kairon by playing his lute. I meant that literally. Dandelion's why I'm here. Came to ask you about him. Know where he might be? No. Sadly, I haven't got a clue. We've not seen each other in ages. Ever since I became Lady Latard, it's been nothing but balls, banquets, and other such... Well, what's it? Congregations. Awful time in all this. But... <laughs> Or maybe his sister could help you. Such a nice girl. Dandelion thinks you're a maidservant? I'm under the impression Dandelion thinks you still serve the Lavalettes. Oh, that's because I never told him I stopped. Didn't want him to treat me any different. And your husband has nothing against it? Your old friendship? Of course not. Sweetiekins couldn't be happier that Dandelion's raising me sophistication. Raising your sophist sophistication? <laughs> remember your last conversation with Dandelion? Any chance you remember your last conversation with Dandelion? Of course. He came to borrow some coin for a barge. What? Why do you need a barge? To take me on a romantic cruise of the canals by the light of the moon. Said there'd be strawberries and that wine with the bubbles, and he'd sing me arias. But I've not seen him since. You're aware Dandelion doesn't have a sister. You do He's realize Dandelion child. doesn't have a sister. Right? Sure he does. Saw him himself. Funny, she don't look like him at all. Blonde, for starters. Maybe they've different fathers. Mm-hmm. Different mothers, too. Maybe. But you could see he cares for her. Looks after her. The way he carried her packages and... I know where I can find her, Dandelion's sister. I know. Whenever I ask Dandelion when we visit her, he'd grow all quiet and then change the subject. <clears throat> Thanks, Molly. Wait. Before you go, I've got a request. This is horse riding. Dandelion told me once he'd show me his etchings, but he never did. 
and I'd so like to see him. Won't be too hard to convince him. He loves showing off those etchings to anyone he can. Oh, that's wonderful. Thanks. And good luck to you on your search. All right, I guess. All right, I'm gonna go back to town, dude. Geralt, there you are. Shall we return together? Yes, I'd like to go back. Gladly. It's a long way to Novigrad. Road ought to seem shorter with some company. I'd say the same. Well then, let's go. <clears throat> Use that guy as a fast travel thing, because this is a long way to Novigrad from there. And I blame Tech as well. That you're losing what? every single duel now, Sharp, eh? Grown so I know, weak. right? I rigged it. I rigged it. <laughs> but only against you, Shark Bay. Tech broke the bot again. But only in a way that makes it to where uh you can't win duels anymore. <laughs> Well, I guess this is where we're going to leave it until tomorrow, guys. <sighs> Thanks, Tech. Damn, Tech. <laughs> Hashtag Bantag. And here we are. Thank you for your company. Likewise. See ya. Alright, let's save here. Hard save. We haven't hard saved since Genie of the Woods. That was like this afternoon. Dang. Yeah. Well, that was a hard save, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does, does, is it, it, this game does a good a job of auto save. Does it not have a quick save? It has auto save. PS4 That's version? really good. He's, can you not hear me, Tate? Yeah, I can hear me. you. I can <laughs> hear you. You said auto save. I was asking about quick save because sometimes you want to save like right before an important uh, dialogue. I think so hard, you can either hard save or auto save. Uh, well, you should at least auto save or hard save then. All right. Yeah. Um. Want to change the title? Use the bathroom. Get another drink. Uh, start up a giveaway, and I'll be right back, guys. Hang tight.